Hey folks, welcome back to another video by BioVet. Today we have a beautiful 2000 fixed roof coupe in Nassau Blue. They only made 189 Nassau Blue fixed roof coupes and this one happens to have 9,000 miles. Today I'm going to show you a trick on the C5 Corvette that a lot of people probably don't know about, but every C5 Corvette can do this. So the first step is to turn the ignition to the run position and clear out any messages that you see on the screen. You'll hit button number four, which is options, and hold it while hitting fuel four times. Once you do that, you'll hit the options button again to manually scroll through your codes. So the first one that comes up is PCM. This is gonna be any engine related code or anything of that such. Uh, this car shows no codes. Uh, the next one is traction control. Um, it says no codes. Uh, BCM, which is the body control module as well, no codes. SDM, no codes. IPC, no codes, and so on. So as you're scrolling through, if you come to one of the screens that shows a code, you actually hit the gauges button and it'll display what the code is. If there's more than one code, you'll hit the gauges button again to scroll through. If you wanna clear the codes, you press and hold the reset button until it beeps. Once, it's beep, once it beeps, the codes are cleared. And then to return back to the main screen, you'll, you'll press your English metric button, which is button number five. Don't be too concerned if there are some codes stored for the door control modules or the HVAC. These are pretty standard and most of your C5s are gonna have some codes. As long as it's not a PCM code, those are the ones that you really need to worry about because that's gonna cause a check engine light. That's all for this tip. Make sure to check back with us for the next one.